on vlog three, five twenty one fifteen. How you doing this morning, Derek? Not good. Sun's no. out. Buns out. Sun's out. Buns out. All right. Sun's out. Thighs out. That's it. Good that, maybe that one too. Yeah. Nothing much, you know. Just yeah. being in class, you know. What about you? You know, nothing much with me. What about you? Oh, I'll see All right. you later. See you later. Are we out here 24 7? We are. No, we're only out here for like seven hours a day. Yeah, something like that. I'd rather have a life of old wells than a life of what if. Hey, do you guys want to be in the vlog? So what do you want to say to the vlog? I'm nervous. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. We love you, Anna Lisa. Love you guys too. At Chicken. Tacos. 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 Okay, since I'm lacking a little bit of footage, I decided to step outside in front of my house and just talk about equating life to a metaphor. So me and AJ have been going back and forth with these two metaphors lately, and it's saying that life is either equivalent to a door. My metaphor is a pickle. You, rel you relate life like a pickle. You get into one pickle, and that's one problem. Once you get out of that, you go into another pickle. So life is just like a pickle jar. And once you move from one, you go to the other, and you're stuck inside of the pickle jar. But there's hope at the end of the pickle jar, because pickle jars are finite. And that's my equation to life. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll go with that. Got it? Yeah. Okay, good. Thank you. Look, I'll make this a good test. So, yeah.